I lead engineering group for what is called the platform and core services for Adobe. This is the group that actually is building the common platform that is becoming the foundation for all Adobe solutions in Experience Cloud. Aerospike is becoming a key component of our edge computation story today, which is becoming the backbone of the data storage, replication and distribution for the entire edge computation for all Adobe infrastructure. Today we see that number of requests that come in for which we need to respond are in the range of several million requests coming every single second. These requests, many of them actually require lookup times in a couple of milliseconds. And we need a stable characteristic. So we always look at 95th percentile, where do we land up? So we have deployed Aerospike today in various different configurations. Different clusters have been deployed. They are deployed on a hard metal. We deployed on actually the virtual clouds. And all these locations today, we are loading the profile data into Aerospike as a database. Aerospike features we are using today, actually the first and foremost is the database on the edges, which is doing a key value store. The second most important thing that we actually look at is that it provides, it's a feature which is the high performance, low latency, high throughput, and providing stable characteristics, extremely important. And the third one that actually gets in would be the replication ability across different edges, which is XDR. With Aerospike, the first, and first thing that's, that started happening was that we can now meet the performance characteristics, whether those are coming from programmatic stack, all the way to personalization, real-time segmentation, entire spectrum use cases can be met with one single system. Without Aerospike being in picture, what we had a situation, and we will have to continue with that situation, was that there were multiple different solutions which were addressing very specific needs of different business use cases. And managing these many different infrastructures operationally was extremely challenging as well as cost prohibiting in long term. Common infrastructures really start benefiting in multiple different ways. We can provide a common programmatic API for everybody, which is developers' experience starts actually improving. Operationally being one single system actually becomes a lot easier to manage. The operational team sizes starts actually dropping. The provisioning and, and deployment starts becoming easy because it's just one system to manage. So all three uh, vectors, if I were to kind of look at, it starts becoming easier for us with one single system.